The chair of the Tesla board has a word about Elon, Solar Roof version 3 has been revealed to the world, and Model X gets a small seat tweak. This is Tesla Tidbits episode number 557 for November 4th, 2019. This show is sponsored by my supporter, Richard. If you're in the market for a new Tesla, please consider using his referral code. Ask your salesperson to use code RICHARD174 or go direct to the web link ts.la slash RICHARD174 and pick up a 1,000-mile supercharging credit for your new vehicle. Leading off this week is a story that came out of Fortune Magazine's Most Powerful Women Summit, courtesy of Teslarati. Since being named Tesla's chair of the board, we haven't really heard much from Robin Denholm. But she had a bit to say regarding what it's like to work at what is probably the most heavily scrutinized automaker in the world. On working in that high-pressure environment with its dynamic CEO, she said, quote, It is a joy to be working in that environment. There are very few people in the world like Elon, and the world needs more of them. In this world, you can't be a disruptor part of the time. You can either be a disruptor and innovator as an individual or not. I don't expect normalcy in that environment, whether it's Elon or one of the other innovators I've worked with, end quote. She went on to praise Elon driving the industry forward, crediting him with where it is today compared with when Tesla entered the market, saying, quote, You can see the progress. Nobody, 15 years ago, was thinking about electric vehicles or sustainable energy with batteries. Today, the fact that the rest of the industry is moving that way is phenomenal. That would not have happened without Elon, end quote. Next up, also via Teslarati, the latest and greatest version 3 of Tesla's solar roof product, also dubbed Solar Glass by Elon, was revealed. It's easy to see Tesla's refining of the product to speed up and increase the ease of both producing and installing it. Previously, the tile dimensions were 14 inches long by 9 inches wide. The new version now puts the dimension of a single tile at 45 inches long by 15 inches wide. In theory, this should cut the install time by at least half, when now only having to install one tile to do the same work that three used to do. The article also notes that the tile costs less to produce and has higher power density as well. On top of all of this, the number of parts in the system as a whole has been reduced as well, again reducing time to install, as well as removing points of potential failure. The new version seems to address everything that was a concern with previous incarnations, and I expect to see Gigafactory 2 churning these out at a higher rate in the near future. Lastly, over at Electric, we see that Model X has received a small tweak to its seats to make life a little nicer for owners. An email that went out to Tesla employees purportedly informed everyone that the new seats are going into new Model Xs being built right now. Among the changes are that the seat is less bulky, allowing a bit more legroom for second row passengers, as well as the addition of a back pocket to give another spot for storage space. Or in my case, if I own one, another spot for my kids to hide trash. One final note tonight is that thanks to a kind listener, my issue with the wrong touch-up paint that I was sent will be solved with a side benefit for somebody in the audience. I'm apparently not the only one this has happened to, but that listener happened to get a multi coat red as his mistake paint. Having been unable to return it in time, he said he'd ship it off to me to use. Because of that, I now have a spare obsidian black touch-up kit on my hands. Rather than send it back for a refund, I thought I'd offer it as a rather specific giveaway to a lucky listener, since I already planned on paying for it anyhow. Here's how I'm going to work this one. If you've got an obsidian black car and would like a shot to win the kit, simply tweet at Tesla Tidbits and say, quote, I can use a touch-up, end quote. I'll pick a winner at recording time on November 14th and announce it on the November 15th show. And that is it for today's show. Thanks to all my patrons supporting the show at patreon.com slash Tesla Tidbits. And as always, a special shout out to all the super patrons supporting the show at the $10 plus level. They're Ryan Scarborough, Lee Sweet, William Henry Crew III, Dorian Steve Guberman, Ralph and Cheryl Waterhouse, Adam Raymer Brown, Megawatt Photovoltaic Development, Todd Sullivan, Mitch Long, Zortec LED Canada, Morvin Og, Raymond and Deborah Malkowitz, T Sport Line, Travis and Cheyenne Rush, Chris Hovis, Craig Murphy, Vicky Kirk, Ricky Johnston, Bien Concepcion, Nathan Garza, Paul Gona, Ed Patterman, and Sunil Joseph. If you have feedback for me, the best way to be heard is to tweet at Tesla Tidbits and use the hashtag AskTeslaTidbits if you'd like your question to be considered for the show. Until next time, keep it charged and hit the road.